the people who make the Kia Soul, yes, the car, has a VST plug-in now. Why? I don't know. Link in the description box. I want to hear from you guys in the comments. Yeah, I want to read it. When you click on the link in the description box, it takes you to Kia's website. Of course, this is where you will get the plug-in. And there's a pretty interesting article here that I want to read. It says, the science behind movement. Uh, the sounds of movement in nature produce what's known as pink noise. This increases alpha waves in the brain, inducing the flow state of consciousness. So we on our hippie shit today, I, I guess. The state in which the brain is at its most creative. These natural sounds were recorded all over the world and used to develop the one of a kind instrument that we call movement. To induce the flow of state further, every composition should be arranged following these four neuroscientific parameters. So it says right here, science one BPM, it says 120 BPM in which synchronization of the heartbeat elects the positive calm flow. So that's pretty interesting. And then science two, uh, harmonic progressions, harmonic variations are better remembered by the listener and active uh, certain areas of the brain. So it's cool that they did a little bit of research on that. That's kind of my vibe there. So the next one is melodic intervals. I'm not gonna read that. I'm just gonna allow you to read everything else. Uh, you would download it over here. Uh, I have a Windows laptop, of course, so I would download it from Windows, but it's uh, available for Mac. So let's go ahead and click on that and get this thing started. I'm gonna go ahead and select keep. It's at the bottom left side of the screen here. And there it is. So the next thing I'm gonna do is just click on this and then install it so that you guys can see it. It says more information. So they didn't verify through Windows, but hey, it is what it is. It better not tear up my computer. That's all I got to say. I click yes to approve it for administration rights. And then I'm gonna click next, next, install, and then go through that process and I'll be back shortly. It's finished, so I'm gonna go ahead and click finish. And then I will do all the other stuff and then we'll pull it up in a DAW of some sort. Well, I'm scanning the NPC software right now, so that's what we're gonna do. You already know the vibes. So here is Kia's movement right here. You can hear that it has some kind of ambience to it. All right, let's try it. Let's go. I think this plugin is meh, but it has potential. And the main reason why I like it is because the soundscape that it has right here is obviously a Rompler synth. But uh, one thing I, that gets on my nerves is the sounds, but some of the sounds are pretty good. Like this bass, that's a perfect bass for house music, you know? But the other thing is going through the patches, it's kind of hard to distinguish uh, which patches that you can play more than one note. They seem like to be single voiced uh, sounds. And that's kind of irritating because I would love to hear some of the soundscaping over some other sounds that they have made, you know, when they were sampling. And, and they didn't put that in consideration. And obviously, uh, if you are just tuning in for the free loose part of this video, uh, I, I just wanted to show, show you, you know, that is monopoly. Uh, it definitely needs for more polyphony. But the UI is pretty simple to understand. You have a VCO. And you can double tap on a parameter, fine tune, pulse width. 
noise, verb. You know, th this is very simple. Like, this is a very simple rompler synth that has a lot of potential. If it had more than one voice, uh, let's turn that off. Let's go ahead and see if it does. That's octave right there, so. Uh, that's kind of disappointing. So, yeah, no polyphony, and that kind of kills the usefulness of this plugin. So, tell me how you feel about this video. I definitely want to hear from you guys in the comments section. Uh, do you think the movement plugin is great? I think the idea is amazing, to be fair. I like the different soundscapes that they, they give you with this plugin. However, uh, the thing that I would say that needs improvement the most is the polyphony. Uh, you can only play like single voice sounds and that kind of hinders the value of it. However, the potential of it is pretty decent for a rompler synth. Yeah, I, I don't want to discourage people that are getting into something, a new venture, and they actually did a little bit of scientific work. So, you know me, I'm a science nerd, and I have deep feelings for other science nerds. No, don't do that. Pause. Don't do that.